Hey guys, welcome to Zish Fitness, it's Grant here. We're coming to you today from my own personal lockdown lair where I've been living busy for the last few weeks and doing all my workouts from. Today we're gonna to be doing a hit session using very light dumbbells for the shoulders, okay? So I recommend don't go crazy with those dumbbells with the weight of them, all right? Because after about 30 seconds of these exercises, you're gonna be feeling a complete awful burn going on in your shoulder, so please, Go light and do it right, okay? Because no matter what you're lifting today, it's gonna hurt. All right, so we're gonna do three exercises, 20 seconds of each, 10 seconds rest in between. We're gonna do that four times, and then we're gonna change up those exercises. So we're gonna start with a Cuban press, which is keeping the dumbbells nice and close to the body. We do a high pull and up into a press. Now, try not to do a bicep curl up into them. It's a high pull up into the press, okay? After that, we're gonna keep the hip, the dumbbells a couple of inches away from the hips, so try not to rest them down here. And we're gonna raise them up in line with the ears, a side lateral raise, just like so. After that then, we're gonna do a halo. We take one of the dumbbells, hold it out front, do a full rotation, and then we come back the other way. Okay, so that's the first three exercises we're gonna do. Well, we can't put this off any longer, so we're gonna get started in 10 seconds with the Cuban presses. So, dumbbells ready to go. And four, three, two, one, and away we go. Remember, keep those dumbbells in tight to your body for the Cuban press. Try not to bring them out too far in front of you. So it's a high pull. You will feel it much tougher doing it like this rather than doing a reverse bicep curl. And stop. Now we're getting ready for the side level raises. So keep the hands about four to six inches away from your hips. It's nice and slow and controlled. And we're gonna raise them up, away we go. And don't uh, worry if you feel a bit puny using some light dumbbells here, guys. Already, we're on lap number one, and I can feel these burning. Okay, so set one to the side, grab a hold of the dumbbell, get ready for the halos. So we're gonna bring the dumbbell out in front, and away we go. Keep it in tight behind your head, and bring it out fully straightened out in front of you. Stop. Good job. We're going back to those Cuban presses. One lap done. Three to go. And three, two, one. Let's go. And stop, we're getting ready for those side level raises. Hopefully you guys are feeling the burn at home as well, not just me. Keep the hands away from the hips. And let's raise them up again. Try not to rest them on the side of the hips. Try not to swing or arch, arch your back throughout. Keep the body nice and still. And don't let them rest down by the pockets. And stop, good job, we're going into the halos. Take the time to give yourself a shake in between. And three, two, one, away we go. And stop. Okay, back to the Cuban presses. If they're not burning yet, they're gonna burn after this one. And three, two, one, let's go. that one good stuff and we're back to the side level raises in five 
four, three, two, one, let's go. Stop, good job, quick shake out. Back to those halos. Nearly finished round three. And three, two, one, let's go. Good stuff. Last lap coming up. Get the lactic acid shifted out of them. And three, two, one, let's go. And stop. Set so our raises coming up next in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. And stop, and we're back to the halos. And three, two, one, and away we go. And stop, good, okay. That's our first batch of exercises done. Give those shoulders a good shake out. Give yourself a little stretch. Give those deltoids a little bit of time to breathe here before we jump into the next three exercises. Okay, so hopefully I'm not just being a complete wuss here and you guys are feeling the burn here big time. My shoulders are uh, pretty pumped. Um, and I'm not using very heavy dumbbells at all. Okay, so again, do it light, do it right, and go for the burnout rather than going for really heavy weight and doing sloppy reps. So the next three exercises we're gonna do is gonna be up like so. So try and keep the dumbbells in line with the eyes rather than resting them down here. We open up, we press up, we bring it back to here. So it's like you're playing peekaboo with the dumbbells. Okay, after that we're going to do alternate front raises. So up for one, up for two. Again, back stays nice and straight, core stays strong. Try not to swing up with them, okay? It's not a kettlebell swing. After that we're going to go for rear delt raises. So we're going to tilt forward in the bend over row position, keeping the back nice and flat. And we're going to widen the arms out. Now, when we're doing this, try not to push the shoulders forward and bring the dumbbells out behind you. Try and keep the dumbbells in line with your shoulders, okay? So, there's the three exercises. Now it's time to do them. Again, 20 seconds of each in a circuit four times. And we go in three, two, one, and let's go. Even holding the dumbbells up this high right now. Should be putting quite a bit of a burn on in the shoulders. And stop, good. So we're going into our front raises next. We're going to alternate. And again, try not to push the hips into it. Keep the core strong, keep the back straight, and try not to arch. And away we go. Just bring it up slightly higher than your eyes. Stop, now we're going into a uh, rear delt 
Riz is next, okay. So, soften the knees, keep the back flat, and away we go. And take your time with the reps, try not to rapidly flick the dumbbells up towards the ceiling. Be in control at all times. Stop, good job. Back to your piggy boo presses. That's not the real name, that's just what I call them. So you remember. And away we go. Again, guys, I'm using light dumbbells here, but they feel ridiculously heavy at this stage. Doesn't take much for your shoulders to burn out. Good stuff. Now we're going to do our front raises again, alternating. Start with the left and under the right. And away we go. Good stuff. Uh, we're into our rear delt raises next. In five, four, three, two, one, and away we go. Again, keeping those hands in line with the shoulders. Try not to pronate the shoulders forward. Try not to jerk the exercise or the dumbbells up. Stop, good job. Quick shaky shake. Two laps done, two more to go. And three, two, one, let's go. And stop, we're going back to front raises. And four, three, two, one, let's go. Good stuff, now we're going rear delt raises. In five, four, three, two, one, and let's go. And stop, we're going on to our last lap next. Quick shake out. And ready to rock in three, two, one, let's go. Just go to your happy place. Try not to think about the burn that's happening in your deltoids right now. And stop, now we're going to our front raises. Nearly there guys, let's keep it going. Three, two, one, and let's go. And stop, and we're into our rear delt raises to finish. In five, four, three, two, one, let's go. And stop. Oh. 
Thankfully, we can rack those dumbbells back up again because we are done. Now, I hope you're feeling the burn like I am right now. My shoulders are absolutely fried at this stage. And I want to use a couple of light dumbbells there and I got a really good workout from it. So hopefully you guys did as well. Remember guys, if you like what you saw here today, check out our videos. We got 235 or thereabouts hitting pretty much every muscle group. We've done from home, gym, wherever you want. Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you never miss a Zeus Fitness workout again. And also check out our six week shred just launched recently. We've been getting some great results and some great feedback from it. Dumbbell workouts to be doing from home and a six week plan to get you in the best shape of your life. So, thanks for coming guys. See you real soon.